Cool. Uh, it's Hot 937. I'm Jenny Boom Boom. Jenny Boom Boom. Here with Soldier Boy, who I've never met before, and it's very nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too. How you doing? Doing good? I'm great. And you're how old now? 18. And you're a self made millionaire. Yes, sir. Yes, how much money do you yes, have at this point? You must have crazy money. I made my first meal when I turned 16. Yeah. I'm, too, I'm, I'm, I'm eight figures in the game right now. Can I say something? Like being 34 years old and, and can't put two dollars together, I, I, where do you get that? Like, where do you get the ideas? Like, where do you get the energy? Like, how do you make that much money? Um, I believe in hard work and determination. You know, ever since I was young, I always wanted to. I mean, I just ain't never. You know, of course, uh, everybody like dreaming about having a lot of money, but it wasn't just necessarily me having a lot of money. I was dreaming about becoming a superstar. You know what I'm saying? All I wanted coming into this was just to have a music video on TV. That's all I wanted. 50 Cent told me recently that he admires you so much. He told me that if there was one person that he could pick out of the whole list of rappers that he feels he admires you the most, the reason being is because you did it on your own and didn't rely on anybody to do it for you. That's what it is, man. Likewise with 50 Cent. And, uh, you know, what's going on with your website? Like, how many hits are you at? Is it on YouTube? What, what, where yeah. are your hits at? Um, I got 400 million views on YouTube. <laughs> Unbelievable. Um, like... 40 million on my, well, 70 million on MySpace. The Twitter, I'm at 700,000 on Twitter. Yeah, you said you have a secret to passing Puffy and Ashton Kutcher. What's it, what's it going to be? Tell me the secret. I want to tell I can't, I can't. I, it won't be a secret no more if I talk. Come on! Come on, boom, boom. Come on. <laughs> Come on. But, um, now, but, um. When will you pass them, you think? 30 days. Okay, 30 days from now. 30 days. Okay, you'll be at where? Where are they at? Mm. They're a little over a million, right? A little over a million, yeah. So you'll be over a million? Yeah. And your ringtone game is crazy. Crazy ringtones is crazy, man. Turn my swag on, it's killing the radio, kiss me through the phone. I'm just staying at it, man. I just got out of the studio with Snoop Dogg, man. We made a banger, man. Shout really? Out. For your third yeah. album, right? For his album. Oh, for his album. His album. But you're yeah. already working on your third album, working right? Working on my third album. Shout out to Kanye, shout out to Wayne. I'm doing this, uh, the, the summer tour this year with Wayne, me and Wayne, and Drake and Jeezy doing the tour this summer starting in July. Um, That's bananas. I'm doing the LeBron James movie soundtrack. Um, I got two upcoming films that I'm that I'm starring in. Shout out to Nick Cannon. He he directing the first one. Wow. And um, and, you know, I recently just landed my first um actor role in the TV show The Game on the CW Network. Okay. Yeah. So that was like my first. Get my feet wet and trying to act. You know. Yeah. Do you ever like think like, damn, I accomplished so much and I'm so young? Um, yeah, man, it, it hit me, man, when I was in, me and my homie, man, Mike, we was in Cancun, Mexico, man, and we were just sitting out, like, on the, on the, out on the balcony, and it was looking at the water, and I was just like, man, this is it right here, because it was like a Scarface thing, you know what I'm saying? Right, you're like, like, I'm king of the world! Yeah, I was just like, man, this is it, it don't get no bigger than this, because, you know, I done came from the bottom of the bottom, I'm talking about, I'm talking about apartments, I'm talking about duplex houses, I'm talking about the ghetto, I'm talking about the hood, you know what I'm saying, where I, where I was raised at, you know, me and my mom and, you know, my little brother. But, you know, hard work, do what hard work will get you, man. I don't ever forget that. What have you been able to do for your family? Like, what's the best thing that you've been able to do for your family since you got you Christmas. Know, like, Christmas. Yeah. That's the best you time. You really spoil everybody on Christmas? Yeah, that's the best time of the year, man. Because I remember waking up on Christmas and not getting nothing. You know what I'm saying? That's not a good feeling, man. That's really not a good feeling. And I, I don't know want my little brother or my little sister to have to experience that. Mm. So what do you buy them? What was the most extravagant gift you bought your family so Most far? extravagant gift? I mean, my little brother and sister, they ain't want them but the iPod. iPod touch, that's all they asked for. Like, okay. We iPods, but you know they got like the little computers and stuff like that, but that's all they asked for. Oh yeah, the iPods. So I'm simple. This week you were on, um, you were on the internet smoking reefer. Cushed up, man. Blueberry perk, man. What's going? What's going on? Blueberry perk mixed with the uh, mixed with the with the skittle Kush, bubble gum, dro, his own dick. Yeah, I don't really know too much about all of that, but power pack, man. Gotta keep, gotta keep my mind right, man. I'm, I'm doing so much. You know, I'm young. You gotta say so much. How you do so much? How you make so much money? Gotta keep my mind right. I've, I've been having a nervous breakdown out here, man. Did it bother you when the video got posted, or did you post the video yourself? Me? Nah, no, I ain't post the video myself. Or oh, media take, I posted the video. It ain't bother me at all, man. You know what I'm saying? They got a hold of the video. Oh yeah. How how did they get a hold of it? Do you think? I don't know. Vlog site's crazy, man. Vlog site. Oh, you know, you are king of the vlog sites. Yeah, but me, man, you know, I, I just I ain't really taking no kind of way because I don't want to hold nothing back from my fans. You know what I'm saying? This this, this is me. You know what I'm saying? So I think that's like, the best way to be. Instead of trying to be someone phony and then being found out later, I think it's just best to be the person you are. Just be honest all yeah. the time. This is me. Cause I don't think you like you know when Chris something like when Chris Brown this thing messed up with Chris Brown like look at now. It is, man. It's you know. Messed up situation, man. Yeah. So um, also uh, let me just quickly ask you about this. Like you have a gun in every room of your house now. Within everybody, your bodyguards outside told me they were strapped. Just mm -hmm. want to let you know what I was trying to come in. So, so you um, you just really stepped up your security. 
Right. I mean, it's just it's just certain precautions that you got to take, man. You know what I'm saying? It's crazy out here, man. It's just 2009. You know, oh, it's a recession. A lot of people ain't like eat. You know what I'm saying? To see a person like Soulja Boy, see me eat, man. See me jeweled up. And he has so much jewelry. My gosh, how just, much? How much is that worth? All together, man, this probably hit me for about 180 racks. Oh wow, that's. But crazy. it's just it, you got to take certain precautions, man. Got to be safe, man. Okay. Yeah. Well, Soulja Boy, thank you. Boom boom. Hey, you need to cut that.